are channel dance channel everybody dance now yeah so, yeah we just start, started up our, our project so we're gonna just film and uh, show to people like some you know some we want to share some experience from people like you and we're honored to have you here with us today good evening everybody good evening <laughs> yeah. hello good evening. hello it's a pleasure for me as well and i think is a it's a very interesting project yeah thank you uh, so we actually want to want to have some suggestions from you for the dancers so it's not about the technique it's more about emotional things mm. uh, uh, for, i'm a dancer myself and we have many dancers in our channel and uh, sometimes we struggle with the problem like like when you start to fight or how to how to avoid the so for example you get angry you mm. do something like just goes wrong just goes yeah. wrong and you just get like winding up and how mm. how to you of know, course i change. think as uh, everybody is, uh, should find a uh, strategy and a feeling to how to solve uh, the moment of uh, uh, the difficult moment that they can have uh, in practice or in competition and uh, I think is a very personal uh, problem and a very personal also how to solve how it. Uh, each one should find their uh, uh, they idea to how to make a work. And maybe uh, maybe depend, depend of the feeling, depend of the emotion of the, of the people. Uh, I remember that there is uh, in some part of my career that uh, uh, I concentrate more in my breathing and uh, like try to make myself calm by have uh, more correct breathing during my practice during my uh, to control also the the, the tension uh, especially during the competition uh, Another point that I remember is I can just tell you what it is my experience let's, let's, let's and uh, you, you of course that. is uh, what I would like to point down that not we are not everybody the same and each one that you have to find they uh, they feeling their emotion their strategy how to control the tension one of the, another point is like that uh, which I was practice always into my studio and uh, I think uh, in dancing is very important also the vision what you have and uh, when you are in your comfortable place or in your comfortable zone that you know where is like uh, uh, short side long side and uh, you have a better connection with the floor because you practice always in the same uh, kind of floor I felt difficult when I start to go into compete outside and I start to change many place when I go into dance and uh, uh, I remember for example if you if I was if I speak about the, the major event uh, you're going to dance uh, in a black pool and the floor is different uh, proportion that you're going to dance in international the floor uh, was also uh, different proportion also different uh, wood uh, different uh, parquet uh, in German Open as well, uh, you understand? And uh, I remember that before the competition, I used to go in to find that kind of uh, uh, harmony with the floor, harmony with the atmosphere. And I remember to uh, just, I've I been there just to walk around, to walk around to make myself confident with the atmosphere, make myself confident with the floor. And I remember it was helped to have uh, started the competition in a positive way. Uh, I have to point down that after, uh, during my career, I also analyzed that uh, when you have uh, uh, and a good practice, uh, because you practice the principle and the fundamental and uh, you feel everything's going correct balance uh, and uh, connection and uh, timing for sure you have uh, you have time also to enjoy it's not that uh, you go into the competition you feel of balance of course we are uh, artists and we have to be actor and sometimes we have to squeeze our tea and show that we even enjoy even that we feel ourselves yeah, yeah. that we don't enjoy but uh, of course everyone has to find a personal way how to 
creating this kind of a feeling inside them themselves. But in the end, uh, I would like to advise everyone that they don't have to lose the point to uh, find this kind of uh, good feeling by using the correct principle and the correct technique and the correct uh, idea that uh, improve the quality of their dancing. Well, thank you very much. Uh, but another thing I, I'm thinking of is that it's it's a, you're saying about your feeling mm. and it's advice. I mean, it's really wise. I mean, I, I understand the point. But you know, the people are different. You ha we have a couple of partnerships. So, you, for example, you 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 get anger or whatever. Edita uh, feels like not comfortable. And how you personally like. In, if it's not a big secret, how you personally solve the situation? For example, she's not in the good mood, and uh, or you, how, how how you help each other? Each is how, so how in, also in this uh, way. I had uh, I had experience because before I was dancing with Alessia, and uh, uh, it's different character than Edita. So uh, maybe some ways. I mean, like yeah, it's it's like. Uh, I, I feel that with Edita, uh, she's also very emotional, she's also uh, very precise and uh, I try to always uh, uh, listen, listen what she asks me and uh, try to make more, uh, to also give to her my idea, but more uh, like share the idea. I remember that with Alessia I was uh, uh, in a way more leader about that I give my idea and uh, she was ready to receive my idea. But this is, is uh, character wise, yes. you understand? And uh, luckily I don't have a lot of uh, fighting and partner, uh, partnership uh, with some other uh, mm -hmm. people. So therefore why I really believe that when the people have long partnership as a better result because not just because the body they start to make a better quality in dancing but also because mentally they become one unit mentally they start to know each other how to uh, how to uh, communicate to get immediately what they want for the from the other person and this is unfortunately when we have new partnership it's difficult to find because we don't really know each other so uh, it's not easy to give the advice to everybody about this kind of uh, idea. I think that is very uh, difficult point. It's difficult, but that's why we are yeah, interested yeah, that's yeah, how, yeah. how to solve this. And then in this video I can just give you my experience uh, what I have in my dancing career. But of course as a dance teacher also I try to immediately find this kind of communication with the couple and understand the character of the lady, the character of the boy and try to give them some uh, guide to where they have to, which direction they have to follow. But of course you cannot work just uh, psychologically. As a dance teacher I have to be also, uh, I have to try my best to improve the quality in dancing. Sometimes uh, you don't really go in deep inside of the psychological problem of the couple. This you can do when uh, you have your uh, student that really go, uh, work frequent, frequent with you and uh, uh, sometimes during the lesson you can touch also this point. But also I'm not a professor in a psychological uh, sport uh, communication. So therefore I just can help them in a way that I can give what I learn in my experience. That's what we see. That I, you have yes, a good for partnership sure, for, for sure, a long time yeah, for and sure. you have maybe some kind of secret that we... No, you know. a, <laughs> I think that the, the body language is the best communication. I also, what I suggest when something is going wrong, to stop to argue to each other and to start to talk with the body during the practice. Because I think this is the best way how to communicate and uh, of course, talk is, doesn't mean that uh, if I am a man, I have just to talk and my lady has to listen, but also I would like to feel also the body of lady that talk to me and should be like a very interesting and uh, normal communication is that one body do the question, the other body do the answer and somebody do the question, the other body do the answer. By the body language is, uh, I think that you will uh, improve your harmony into the couple and you don't waste in time to argue and to talk so much uh, about the problem when you feel in 
practice uh, and of course uh, into the competition if you start to argue it's too late <laughs> since you're already on the day of the so competition you better stop stop, stop talking, talking and, talking and dancing, yeah it's keep on dancing and try to, to finish in the best way the, the, the performance even that you don't feel that is your strong day oh great thank you everybody dance now dun, 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 dun.